here to share some ideas worth spreading and um, do it in a slightly less controversial manner. I'm a Norris Talk and I've been creating tonight's writing for the past two years, so this is our third year. And over the course of this year, we've worked really, really hard to bring today's event to you. I just want to see how many meetings you think we've had. So we started meeting around April. Anyone want to take a guess the number of meetings? We just shout it out. What is what is Real money. 
please do not run up on stage and assault me for this money. Um, I will not let it go. There's actually a really awesome grant going on here from our sponsor, Digital Humanity. And you might have seen those orange slips in your programs. And that allows you to be entered um, for a chance to win this $500 for your amazing idea, 50 words about everyday heroism. So, yeah, we're really making it rain at time starting this year. <laughs> uh, so, with that in mind, think of ideas, think of everyday heroes, think of your piece in the puzzle, and let the third annual TEDx Redmond Games begin. Let the odds be ever in your favor. <laughs> two brilliant people who have put up with a lot of my shenanigans and are going to be your co-hosts for this year's event. Please welcome on Julie Pradeep and Jessica Perrin. Hey guys, hi, I'm Jessica Perrin. Hi, I'm Julie Pradeep, and if you didn't notice, both of our initials are JP, which makes us double JP, your agents of entertainment. <laughs> So welcome to the third annual TEDx Redmond event where the youth makes up 100%. Every single speaker has something to share. They're all passionate and really do care. About helping others and changing lives, making differences. Yeah, that deserves a high five. <laughs> I think y'all can guess that we might be crazy, but thanks for being here, for not being lazy. So we're all the same, all part of the youth, here to make a difference, maybe comfort our sweet tooth. We got it all, just you wait, because this is TEDx Redmond and... Yeah, we don't want y'all to get hurt, so... So in case of fire or emergency, there are two exits in the back, to your right over there, to your left over there, good transition, right? And then another entrance over here, which is also the entrance to the main conference center. I'm at hashtag TEDx Redmond, hashtag YOLO, hashtag I got swag. This is important, Julian. But I'm, you guys can probably think of something more creative than that, to text, tweet, or post on Facebook. But we ask you to please stay on your phones and put them on silent during the conference. During breaks, you can feel free to update all your social networks about your hashtag TEDx Redmond, hashtag swag. But as much as you might have a relationship with your phone, we think that you guys should take this chance to make some new friends too. So before we hear from our very first speaker, let's get to know each other. So Julian, what's your motto? Hashtag YOLO, I got hashtag swag, of course. That goes, you know, right up there with stop the smell the roses and keep calling and carry on. But we want to hear what you have to say, so turn to your neighbor and ask them what their life motto is. Or you can just stare into your neighbor's eyes off the door. Like this. I think you guys are ready. Go. Start. 
now that we've got introductions out of the way, we have our first speaker here to speak to you about going against the status quo. Nikhil and his radical ideas have been featured in the New York Times, NBC, as well as at conferences around the world. Here is Nikhil Bagel. Question, what's your idea worth spreading? Anyone have an idea worth spreading? Where's you the have t-shirt? You have your idea worth spreading. There's one. What is your idea worth spreading? Speak. Speak. Um, writing about what you believe in. Writing about what you believe in? Great. Love that idea. Yeah, one t-shirt. Anyone else? Sorry. Idea worth spreading. <laughs> You're important, your ideas matter, we all want to hear what you have to say. Please, please share what you think. And one more over tweet. here. Tweet, Adora. Tweet on TEDx Red uh, So my idea what's spreading is that uh, uh, I think that, you know, uh, you should be seeing a lot of uh, scientific articles, right, and sociological articles, we see huge growth in uh, urban population, right? Uh, a major challenge over the next 50 years, uh, and one that students uh, in the sciences should start thinking about, but aren't really being trained to do so, is how to transition uh, the functions that rural uh, facilities give you, such as agriculture primarily, to an urban environment, uh, and optimizing that process. Jenkins, someone truly passionate about helping others and giving back. After hearing that just $20 can save someone's life, 
Carter started a nonprofit that builds water and sanitation projects in third world countries. Please give a warm welcome to Carter Jenkins. Okay, well, some of you who have not experienced these, aka you need to have a life, um, <laughs> experience these, you might be entered for a lucky prize. We have some of these to give away. So, Julia and Justin, fire away with questions. Yeah. All right. So, I guess whoever answers these questions gets a gift basket. Right. So, our uh, first question is who can say hello in three different languages? My lingual trilingual people over here. Puzzles, people don't come with pre cut edges. And that means that we can decide where we want to fit. We can decide what we want to be passionate about, the values we want to live, the ideas worth spreading that we want to give voice to. The important thing is that our piecing together of the puzzle doesn't end in one night. It's not just this conference that was really cool that you went to and then you go home and then life resumes as normal. You wait another year or until another conference like this happens again. As Winston Churchill said in some very different circumstances, now this is not the end. It is not even the beginning of the end. But it is perhaps the end of the beginning. And that means the start of our journey. 